Cowboys get CD Lamb hold out warning from ESPN Dan except he is wrong the last Cowboys get CD Lamb hold out warning from ESPN Dan then find out why welcome to this short audio podcast ESPN Dan is a football guy who has a TV friendly charisma but here is no doctor no researcher and no expert on one key subject as evidenced by a new claim he just issued in other of his familiar flaming of for of the last cowboys this time around he insisted that contract dispute with receiver cd lab will almost inevitably lead to on field failure with this premier athlete missed time in training camp usually there is something attached to either their performance or health that is not on par with their expectations Rolovski said on Monday morning, addition of the first take, figurative panic button, at the ready. You say everything will be fine? I disagree, he said. This is a cool go downhill fast for the Cowboys. Whoa, take a breath, Dan. First off, Rolovski, this thesis is based on the idea that the Cowboys won't not sign Lamb soon. We are willing to bet he is allow himself to get caught up in honor Jerry Jones. No urgency. You are missed. Silliness and Dan is there for probably go wrong there. But let but let's buy into his thesis, which boils down if to uh, boils down if a star misses time in a camp, he will not achieve his star level heights in the regular season. Scary stuff, but he but where did um, Olavski came come up with this? Where is even a small sample size of proof? Let's uh, counter his analysis with the, with over thirty five years on the Cowboys beat. Off the top of our heads, and we can come up with four big time cowboys who stage camp holdouts. We covered each of them. They sent, they went something like this. Uh, 1992 Michael Irwin this is our great El Paso story when Irwin writes contract request on a napkin and slides and slides it across the desk to Jones who replies think, thinking he is speaking Spanish for I all pass Irwin spent that summer working out as a vigorous vigorously as ever I went to his house one night to find him running up 10 p.m. block long wind sprint forward and then backward while wearing a 30 pound weight military vest Jones eventually found a way the deal got done on Wednesday before week one. Irwin got nine, got nine passes for 162 yards and scored a touchdown. In week three against the Cardinals, he caught eight passes for 210 yards and three TDs. The Lars won all three of those games. Irwin ended the season as an All-Pro and he keyed a Cowboys win in the Super Bowl. So guys, this is pretty much in this video. I hope you guys really like it. Kindly do subscribe to our YouTube channel and thank you so much for watching. Mm-hmm. <laughs>